Okay, today's Saturday. We are headed towards North, North Bergen. Um, was supposed to rain. Now it might not rain, so that's better for the vendors. Um, made a uh, big event this morning for us. We saw three, uh, four deer, a mama and three babies. Three uh, babies. I didn't know deers could have three babies. I guess you know heading so towards. Don't they the come out pretty? She had to be huge. Yeah, to I would, have three babies in her. Yeah, I would think. You know, I mean, unless they're really small when they're born. But what do I know? They aren't they born and they fall out and then within hours they're standing up. Yeah, I mean, probably an hour. Isn't that like how that. it is? Kind of. I mean. I not a deer person. Yeah. I don't know. My relatives might know. Yeah. Well, I mean, I guess the way they evolve. This, city like, girl don't know. this is like ridiculous how we're getting deer in this area. Yeah. This will be. Look at this area. Yeah. You can everybody. see guys. Like, 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 how are we getting deer? We're not even that because they're close overbuilding. To, yeah. And they're just coming down. They said during COVID, uh, the deer population probably went a little wild. You all, because they didn't hunt. Them. Yeah, they weren't. Nobody was hunting. I don't know if you're allowed to hunt in Jersey anyway. I don't know. I think there's certain parts. Uh, we're gonna make it. Yeah, because I'm pushing it. We made it. Um, we didn't really, but whatever. <laughs> um, Evidence. And I always complain about people doing that, and I just did it. Yeah. Well, you know, it's hard to just slam on your brakes. Sometimes. Yeah, but it's a red light and it was yellow. I should have slowed down. Mm. Well, anyway, back to the deer. So, uh, we keep seeing deer. And uh, I don't know. I don't know what to do. You know, like, uh, we sprayed the rocks. So we went yeah, I got a, like a, a spray to keep animals away because yeah. we had skunks too. For some yeah, reason. skunks. My God. And uh, my landlady worries about them spraying her dog. Yeah. So, and also thinking up the property if they get That's scared, they're spraying it around the house. That's where we went yesterday. Yeah. Um, oh, they're right near Vias. What? The, that church. Oh, the yeah, well, we do, right? Here. Yeah, it's going to be today. Yeah, actually, you could check it out if you want. I mean, I could tell AJ if he wants to go to it, you know. I don't think they'll have much. I mean, unless they got fresh stuff tomorrow, yesterday. You know, all I know is I gave him some stuff. That's about it. Yeah. Said they were crowded in the morning, but once again, it's like that's not one where you, you'll get a lot of great I don't think, you know. Um, but well, here we are. Yes, so there is a line. Is it a crazy line? We What's don't that? know. That's Manny's truck. Yeah, I actually took a little video of the deer. I'll, I'll put it out uh, so you guys can see it after this. Just the three deer. Oh, is Manny here already? Yeah, his truck's in the front. I don't know. Look at that. Well, it's six o'clock on the dot, so. So I guess everybody's here and on time. Except for us, because we're here. No, we're on time. Mm -hmm. All right, we'll park here. All right, so anyway, we did North Bergen and there was nothing to buy there. It rained twice in the morning. Um, so that scared some of the vendors off. So now we're going to check out the Meadowlands to see if there's uh, anything. Uh, the doesn't look full. It does not look full. Last week was crazy when we pulled it at 6 o'clock. Last week it was very full. Um, and we did last week, right? Yeah, but half the people probably don't know this thing's going on still. That's the problem. Maybe. The checks. Yeah. I mean, you know, the rain messes up. I don't know if you guys can see off in the distance. See that big red tent? That's where the metal ends is. Uh, well, actually, that's where the carnival is. I don't know. You know what? Now that we're coming around the curve, I do see cars, so. Yeah, remember, half of them are vendors who come with the cars. Yeah. So we'll see what happens. Hopefully, uh, we'll find some stuff here. Well, I think it's going to be a, a higher chance today. Yeah, there's, there's definitely a higher chance of finding stuff here than there is in no, North Bergen. I, I, I know because of the rain. Yeah, maybe. You know, probably they put their stuff out a little bit later, slower yeah. start. You know, maybe some of the vendors come out a little bit later, so we'll see. Yeah. All right, anyway, we're here. All right, so we're walking around the Meadowlands. Uh, we're gonna go check the outside rows because those are the vendors that got here last. They're the ones that are setting up the, the latest. And if there's anything that hasn't been seen, it would be more over on this side. Probably right, because those people will usually love Yeah, they're there early. People will see what they have first, but all right. All right I, see, I see people I know already. All right, so um, well, I went to the Meadowlands and I didn't buy a lot. I'll show you what I got. I bought some loose games. Here's Grand Theft Auto, Mortal Kombat, um, what is this? Deception, and a Hulk. This is actually a pretty good game. I 
in terms of gameplay. You know, I liked it when I played it. Let's see, I bought some other stuff. Let's see if I can close this. All right. Not a lot. Um, got a Sega Genesis. This wasn't expensive, and it was pretty much complete. You know, it came... Oops, I gotta be careful of this. I'm sure that I don't wanna break that. It ships so easily. I can chip it. All right, so anyway. Okay. Um, Sega Genesis, pretty much complete. Not with a, a newer AV. One of the old school ones, so... Games. Not nothing too exciting. I'm gonna say really, to be honest, today. But you know, it, it was worth shopping. There was one thing that I was gonna buy, or I would have bought. It was this kind of bird, aluminum bird. And this company, the small ones aren't worth much, but the big ones are worth more. But I don't think I could have got. The guy wanted forty, and I think I would get a hundred, and that was too much because if I list for forty. And even if it sells for a hundred, I automatically lose like um, fifteen in fees. Now I'm down to eighty-five, and then to ship it would have been like ten to fifteen. So I might have made seventy-five, um, and then uh, you know maybe thirty-five uh, profit. But the thing is, it's not an easy sell. So I was like, who cares? You know what I mean? Um, and it was one of those funny things where you go to the guy and he goes. He tells you 40 in the morning, so I look it up and I go, oh, I think it's worth 100. So I go, oh, but I think about it, I'll give some, him some time. So I come back, right, and I say, oh, like, what's the best you can do? He goes, 50. I go, oh, it was 40 this morning, how about 25 then, right? So he's like, no, no, no. So I go, 30, and he goes, no, I go, okay, no problem, because I didn't care. Um, this came with a memory card, which is actually a decent size. Um, but it is aftermarket and this um, this year so it's missing the bottom and stuff but it wasn't a bad buy for what we paid and then we were lucky enough to find um, an aftermarket controller to pair it with I always have trouble finding the controllers here let me scoop this stuff AJ's coming back not open okay then maybe we should have went uh, scrapped with what's his name if we're going to do it not open at all no I, I mean we can probably get to my friend um, or we could have went back and gotten what's his name? Ah, whatever. It if he wants to go back to Meadowlands, if uh, or we could just wait. You know, do it uh, after the weekend. No, because okay. Let's try my this. friend because he's going to be paid 99%. Okay, let's try your friend. Um, that CD is wrapped, and actually, I think it's pretty good. Has, um, here's some kind of pods. On, um, oh, I don't have many. That's pretty good. Led Zepp, does he have a store? Yeah. Uh, okay, so that's that's more respectful. Not doing it in somebody's backyard. I'm gonna scrap some gold and silver today. Just because, why not? Um, then this floor is a horizon. Did we buy this as a gift? No. Okay, which one did we buy as a gift? Okay, this may have an issue. I'm gonna hold it up to the light. Okay, you have to watch out for, oh wow, this is really scratched up, dude. Okay, what I'm really looking for right now is called disc rot. But, dude, did you see this? Yes, Tony. You right. buy some questionable things all the time. Not really. Not that Beat questionable. Those guys. Only by mistake. This one's probably okay. All right. Were they both discs in there when you bought it? Or? Only one disc. Oh, there's two. No, the Star Wars. That's what I'm saying. Were both discs no. in there or you bought them separate? Okay. Both separate. Star Wars is for Daryl. Uh, yeah, that's what I was wondering. Okay. And then I bought this. Um, this is in pretty good shape. I don't really see anything wrong with it. This is a clothes in a uh, cigarette type box or a trinket box, but it's a China one made in China, but you could see the way that they do it. So it's not a paper label and it just says China, not made in China. If it says, if it says China, that means it's pre 19, uh, something, 1920, 1910, which would make this a bona fide antique about a hundred years old. I looked all over. I don't see any serious uh, damage or like a lot of times the, the people open it too far and the hinges get fucked. Um, the inside looks pretty good. I don't see any big cracks. Hey, Even sure. the bottom's pretty good. I think this is probably worth, I don't know, rough guess, gonna, 60 bucks is what I'm hoping. All right. And that's all.